What's up, Burroughs? It's uh, another week. We got episode three of Burrow Builds, and this week we have the Rock Rat, a GMC carry all from 1965. So, this here, this here's a carry all. Hashtag Rock Rat. Tyler's driving it. Ryan's in the back. There's Alan. He owns this dumb bitch. Carryall's like a Suburban, but it's a GMC version. It's a four-seater. Your mom and your sister can fit back there nicely. It's all harnessed and caged and all kinds of switches and levers for, to play with. Well, rear seats are out of like a graveyard or something. Front ones are still nice. It's got a stereo. About... 8 million lumens worth of rigid lights. Uh, transfer case, Dana 300, 32 spline output shaft, no big deal. Northwest Fab black box in front of that. So I could do front digs and wheelies and shit. It's been a king of hammers twice just for fun. You guys might have seen it out on a lake bed tearing stuff up. Um, obviously, as a student driver, always. Still trying to figure out how to do that steering thing. Uh, the power plant. Everybody wants to know what's under the hood of this bad boy. And it's an LS17 straight out of a 97 Jeep Cherokee. It's got some K&N intake. Puts up about 420 horsepower. Transmission's a 69 speed AW4 out of the same Cherokee. One ton Chevy steering box, bunch of fab work, uh, Ching Chong Cooley Boy for the radiator, with the shroud that's Ching Chong Spinny Thingy for the for the fan as well. Budget built works real good, kind of. Uh, side exit exhaust, custom muffler. You guys make your own mufflers, cause I do. Bumblebees. It's got window nets for fun so your drunk sister doesn't fall out of the back because it is a four seater. It's got four seats, a couple six by nines, 18,000 watt amp. Uh, it is a rock rat, so it's got obviously it's four wheel drive. Dana 300 transfer case, twin sticked, flipped over for driver side drop. It's got a Northwest Fab black box in there. That's what this screwdriver is. It's a, a shifter. This wrench is actually a wrench. So that's good. Uh, storage for, you know, condoms and whatnot. Optima yellow top out of a semi truck about nine years ago. Uh, three link front. You guys already saw that. Well, uh, bent the rim. that happened. That's good. What happened? We, we might have bent a rim real quick. Oh. Trying to be cool for the gram. Kinked a wheel. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Right there. Woo no biggie. We well, got a, a spare tire. Good thing we got a spare. One of them Ching Chong Wang high lift things. 65 GMC carry all which is like a suburban but not it's a gmc version right 40 inch toyo mts that are flat when you bend the wheels well uh, three out of four is not bad yeah three out of four that's pretty good odds. that's like 75 percent ish um got a shout out to our boy richie at rigid we partnered and oh. put like 80,000 lumens on the front of this thing they're up there they're in the interior there's a whole shitload of them on here what do we got custom bumper Sworn. custom modifications over here Sworn. 97 Ford F350 was a dually Dana 60 ball joint knuckles plenty strong enough for what we're doing kind of 
Yeah, single two and a half inch ADS coilover, two and a half inch hydro bump, two inch stroke. That's literally the, all that's in the front of this thing. There's no fanciness other than the valving. Yeah, but that's fancy. Oh, secret sauce. Yeah, proof that it used to be a dually machined off the wheel mounting surface, modified it. If you look at any other factory Dana 60 hub, it doesn't have this because it would still have a flange on it. Uh, if you guys all want to know Whoa, what the engine is, wheel. we left these back. If anybody wants to give us some beat locks, that would be kind of cool. The steelies. We can't it's, even put like a bro sticker on the side that says method or anything. I mean, that's kind of, that's like cooler, but it's still not a beat lock. It's a and Alan got the high left. What's wrong? It won't do it. <laughs> Here, you need something? It's a piece of fuck. Here's Budweiser. Official sponsorship of high tension.